More details now on a troubling trend that's been discovered at several Massachusetts state parks. Officials are warning visitors to watch out for wires strung across trails. Police are on the lookout for a malicious person looking to hurt people. Iowa to Sioux supporter Kelly Sullivan is live at Freetown State Forest now with the very latest. And we're at the Freetown Fall River State Forest where there have been two instances over the past weekend where there have been wires strung across trails. So now every day there are patrols as well as a volunteer walking those trails looking out for any more potentially dangerous wires. To me, you know, that's attempted murder. A volunteer for 10 years here at Freetown Fall River State Forest, Jesse Babb learned over the weekend where park goers discovered two wires strung across these trails. And as a rider comes along, it's at Nick height, you know, which would be right here, right? So they know exactly where they're putting the wire at. The wires were immediately removed, but the Department of Conservation and Recreation posted these signs after receiving other reports of wires at Franklin and Rentham State Forests. F. Gilbert Hill State Forest is included in the warning as a precaution. I'm looking at him saying, geez, why, why would somebody do something like that? It's kind of silly, you know, for what purpose? I mean, the best way to characterize it is almost evil. Rentham police are upping patrols in the town's state forest. And we'll be there probably for the next couple of days just to keep an eye out for suspicious characters and to inspect the trails for the wires. In the meantime, bikers and runners are also asked to be extra cautious about their surroundings. The difficulty is when you're running, you have to look down so you don't tr twist your ankle on a rock or a, a log or something. I don't want to see nobody get hurt. I mean, that's the you know least thing that we want. You know, everybody's just out here to have a good time. I hope they catch the guy. And of course, if you see any wires, call environmental police. Now, tonight we did reach out to the Rhode Island DEM. They tell us no reports of any wires in Rhode Island and no increased enforcement at this time. Reporting live in Freetown with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, Kelly Sullivan, Eyewitness News.